Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, in this video, we are doing a Halloween tutorial and it is a mosaic tiles look. Um, the very special thing about this tutorial is that I will be using all products that can be found in the Target aisle. Uh, so you guys stay tuned and keep watching to see how I get the look. So the first thing that I did was fill in my brows as you can see and I used the elf liner and brow gel in the shade medium brown I believe and there's a few different colors available in the Target Beauty aisle it's about four dollars and it's actually very comparable to the Anastasia dip brow it's just not as creamy um, that's one of the reasons why I really like it so I went ahead and filled in my brows very bold with that product because as you see the look that we're doing is very bold and now I'm just concealing my brows with the elf foundation and I'm using the shade almond this shade is slightly lighter than my skin tone so it'll make my brows pop in the look So all I'm doing here is taking uh, a little brush to blend out the bottom of my brows and I took the excess and blended it down the bridge of my nose. Now I'm taking a little more of that same foundation. It's okay if the foundation is lighter than my skin. I'm just spot covering because I don't want to put a whole face of foundation underneath the whole mosaic look because it'll all get covered up anyway. So I'm just going in with that same foundation, spot covering a few dark spots, pimples, and all that good stuff. And then I'm taking this bigger brush and basically muting out my lips so that I can get rid of all the color, as you see here. Now I'm going to go ahead in with the Wet n Wild Black Liner Pencil. And this pencil is actually very creamy. It got the color on perfectly. So I'm just going to start drawing a whole bunch of random lines around my face to create the tiles, so to speak. And honestly, I'm just freestyling the design. You can do any design you like or follow what I'm doing, but I'm literally just drawing lines everywhere. And as you can see here, I have a little um, spots that are thicker than the other, but you don't really have to worry about that because you can either go over it with the liquid lipstick later when you fill in the triangles or just leave it a little thicker. I left some of the spots a little thicker just to add dimension to the look. And this is what I came up with as far as my design. <laughs> you can add more smaller triangles or spaces if you want, um, but I pretty much kept mine like this. So the first product I'm using is the L'Oreal Infallible um, Liner, and it's a light blue kind of teal, uh, and it's actually a really nice felt tip liquid liner. And then I went ahead in with a whole bunch of different colors in liquid lipstick. I'm showing you each of the colors of liquid lipstick before I apply them. And then I'll go ahead and label all of them in the description box so you guys know which colors I used. I basically just used a couple different brushes and filled in all of the circles on my, or spaces, not circles, but triangles and squares and all that. I filled them all in with a brush and different liquid lipstick, different eyeliners and stuff like that. So like I said, I'll have them all in the description box so you guys know what colors I use. And I'm going to stop talking now <laughs> so you guys can just watch what I'm doing because it's pretty much straightforward from here.
And as you can see here, I took my head wrap off because my edges were basically already laid. <laughs> so I went ahead and took that off and filled in the space on my forehead so that it kind of blends in a little better. And as you can see, I also filled in some of the spaces in solid black just so that I wouldn't have too many colors of the same like next to each other. So I filled in some of the spaces in solid black. And then after this color, I actually used the uh, blue mascara from L'Oreal so that I'd have like a royal blue color to add to this look because I felt like it just needed a pop of blue. So I used that L'Oreal um, mascara <laughs> and filled in some of the spaces and as you can see I actually left the space underneath of both of my eyebrows blank so that I could put some highlight underneath there you know so it's a little more popping um, but yes I used the Milani uh, strobe light highlight in the shade 03 all right y'all and that is all for this mosaic tile tutorial I really hope that you all enjoyed this super super creative and different Halloween look and I also hope you guys enjoyed the case using all Target products uh, liquid lipsticks and eyeliners and all of that good stuff you guys let me know in the comments below if you love this look um, I am obviously digging it <laughs> Um, but yeah, so you guys keep up with me, subscribe to my channel, hit the bell so you know when I post my videos every Sunday, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!